Hello everybody, my name is Edson and welcome to a very special video. I'm going to just intro this just to start off. Um, basically I was invited um, by the awesome Strats who has created a Minecraft game show based on the TV series Would I Lie To You. Now if any of you guys don't know what this is, it's a TV show in the in UK. I don't know if they've got other versions in different countries. But the, the main premise of it is there's two teams, there's a host and each person on the team gets randomly drawn out and you um, submit some truths about yourself and some lies. Um, and essentially you need to say the, the truth or lie and the other team needs to determine whether it's a truth or a lie. Um, you can think, you can like basically play it off like you can try and, um, so if it's a truth, you can like try and like stumble your words and like make the story not sound believable or like make some of the parts of the story not add up. Um, to make them think that you're lying, but you could be double bluffing. There's like so many different things you can do in it. And there's supposed to be quite funny stories that you can sort of like just rip into the other person about. Um, and everyone takes it in good fun and everything like that. And he's done one in Minecraft. Now this is a very early beta test. The set is very uh, like open and not very sort of like built up. Um, the the true or false thing that's supposed to come up behind the, the, uh, the person that's hosting it, which is Strats, um, doesn't actually work. Uh, it did work once, but it, it didn't work again, um, and we didn't. We only had two players per team, so there's a lot of things that were wrong. But I'm just going to give you guys a couple of the rounds um, we did. I think it was me and Oddmast on one team, Star and Ed Case on the other. Strats was hosting it, and it was um, I think Penny. I'm not going to say. Well, I can actually say because I'm not. I, I don't even think I posted them in the right order, but they went up three or four maybe even five nil and then we brought it back to five or six three i think in the end um but i'm only going to show you guys three rounds so i'm going to show you guys the two rounds that i did where i told a truth or lie um because i think you guys might find them interesting um and i'm going to show you what the, the i think it was the very first round uh which was a, a truth or lie from penny so there's going to be three rounds that you guys see the video will be about 15 to 20 minutes long depending on this vlog um, and hopefully you guys enjoy it. Please let me know in the comment section down below because I'm going to link strats to this video um, What you guys liked about this and what you guys didn't like obviously you didn't see the full thing The full thing was like an hour long because we were like testing Stuff and things were going wrong and we were just like talking in between rounds and stuff um, And there's a lot of like suggestions that I've made and I'm going to do a little bit of a vlog at the end Just to talk about that um, also, if you do want to watch the full thing, Penny has actually, or I believe she is, going to be editing the full thing into like one long podcasty thing. So if you do want to listen to that, link's in the description. If it's out yet, if not, check back in a couple of days. Um, and yeah, enjoy it. I used to eat ants when I was younger. Plausible. How old? <laughs> Wait, yeah, how, how, old, how old, old was this? Like five, Please don't say like yesterday. Like yesterday. <laughs> like yeah. yesterday five, when I was, six years ago. Yeah, when I was younger. <laughs> and I say younger, I mean a day younger. <laughs> no, <laughs> like... I would say like five or six. And why Could would you, you eat describe ants? the uh, the palate of a of an ant? I don't remember what, that one. I think it was just sort of crunchy. Wait a minute, you, you want her to just describe the palate of <laughs> of an ant? No, no, no. no wait, wait, wait. Oh, how you know how I mean. is it? Like, how did this come about? Did you just like were you outside and you just saw loads of ants and thought, you know what, I'm hungry? How little was... did your parents feed you? <laughs> well, funnily enough, it would explain a lot about uh, the lack of height. Funnily enough, it was, I, I'm pretty Ooh. sure it was the Lion King because, you know, they eat bugs in it. And I was like, oh, they seem like they have so much fun, Akuna Matata. So I like to eat bugs as well. I actually um, had a... Um, so sorry. you thought the one sorry. link between you and the Lion King that was not holding, like, the one thing that was <laughs> between you and the Lion King was eating ants. <laughs> they looked yummy. They, they were, what is it? Slimy yet satisfying. Wait, it's an, it's an sidebar. I don't think there are ants in the Lion King. No, but they ate bugs. I Well, that's not an ant, is it? I lived in like the American suburbs. I didn't have access to like. Wait, and, an and how long did this go on? For? Was this like a one-time thing, or was this like like your? It, your it wasn't for very for, like, long because I remember my mum telling me off for it, and I never wanted to do it again because I didn't like being told off. Well, I, I believe I, that bit. I washed them. I remember washing them. <laughs> oh, you washed them? Oh, wait, ants. what? Wait, we get into a whole other thing here. You washed oh, the ants. So like, well, no, because basically, like, you know, ant hills are all dirty, so they're made of dirt, so you have to wash the ants. Like, how many ants would you eat at a time? Just like a little handful. A oh, little well, handful? So, yeah. so, so, so she was a mass murderer? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. So, like, a little handful is still, like, we're talking, like, double digits here. Yeah, this is, this is, I would say, I would say, oh my gosh, <laughs> this can't be true. It, if well, this like, is true, eat, I'm shocked. You wouldn't oh. eat just one or two yeah. ants, would you? <laughs> 
Oh Are my god. Are you going to vomit? Go- oh vomit my, no, no. Hold on. Just no. Hold on. I'm not, I'm not feeling too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the writing's on the wall and the floors I mean, is everywhere. The, the thing is, as much as I don't want this to be true because it's, I... well, disgusting, I, I feel like it's true. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm thinking back to when before the show when Penny was talking about how she talked to her mum, and I feel like she she went to her mum and said, <laughs> "Should I tell the ant story?" And she just her mum was like, "We never speak of the ant story." <laughs> so I'm I'm still not. Sh- what do you I, think? Truth. I think it's truth. Oh, I right? could. I can see it. I've got to believe it. True. It is Sad. a lie. Ah! No! Uh, yes. <laughs> Did you press a button? <laughs> I didn't no. press it. Oh, do I have to press it? No, no. You don't have to, though, because it takes so long for it to change. <laughs> Too late. I pressed it. It's a lie. Right. Halfway, halfway through the next story, it just goes true. <laughs> <laughs> Spoilers. Okay. During a day at school, I was run over by a hijacked car. <laughs> <laughs> If that is true, then you just seriously laughed at him for something horrible that happened. He's alive, isn't he? He's here. <laughs> Wait, have I? Okay, hit me. To, to what extent were you run over? Well, and by what car? His, what was his, the car? His little toe. <laughs> <laughs> no, I got like clipped. Um, so what? What car was it? It was. It was like this. It was this. I think it was a white Corsa. It was like some crappy car that we later found out was hijacked. What Again, um we, we didn't, what year school? Uh, I was I was about like year seven or eight. Oh my oh. Wow, so like 11, 12. Jesus. Mm-hmm. Did you catch the bugger? Um no. <laughs> oh. oh. How did you know the car was hijacked? Uh because it like was ditched and burnt later on. <laughs> oh my god. Yes. <laughs> They, they said, "I'll come back for you later." <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah. Um, were you, where was it? Just outside of your school? No, no. It was. It was in. It was on my um, in the on the sports fields. Like we were like. Oh. Wait! You just drove through the sports fields. Yes. Oh my god! Did you? Not, how did you not notice it and move out the way? <laughs> um, no, like we we did, but like. It, he it came was straight it, no, it, 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 it was. It was like. Sore, so it was like. It was jealous of you. It was. It was. It was raining, fan. and it sort of like it was drifting all over the place, sort of thing. So yeah, Jesus. and it was going quite the speed, and we didn't see it till last second. Mm. 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 What so were you playing? We we were just we were walking through the fields to go home. Oh, so you weren't even playing. Mm-hmm. You weren't when... playing. <laughs> no, sadly not. Where did it come from? Where did it go to? <laughs> Where did it come from? Cotton it I came joke. like because oh, like <laughs> there's like this um there's this sort of like road that leads up to like this astroturf thing where like it's like, it's like this all weather pitch um and then like he like there's like a like a couple of fields behind it and it sort of drove around the side and we were like we there's like this cut through or used to be in like the corner of the top fields that like went straight to my house like the road. Um, so we're walking up there to go to there and it just came from behind us and we heard it last second and jumped out of the way sort of thing. So did you have to, so you said it clipped you, did you have to like, did it open a wound? Did you have to go to hospital? Or? No, luckily enough, I, I mean, when you're that age, you're made of rubber and magic. So it's not really like, <laughs> you, you just bounce back from anything. So I was, I was actually pretty much unharmed. I got a, like a big bruise and that was about it. You what were unharmed, car hit you. Yeah, it, it, it hit me. Like, How fast? Uh, it must have gone about 30. Okay. Which part of the car hit you? Like the front, le- like one of the front corners and it clipped <laughs> like, it, 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 it clipped like the the corner of me and like took out like like one of my <laughs> legs basically. Today I learned Edson's a square. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Thomas was alone IRL. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I mean, I believe that you know, his school exists and the field exists. He (laughs) seems to know his geography of it well. But I don't know if I believe the fact that, like, you you wouldn't be able to avoid a car in a big open field. Like, And if if it was travelling at some fair nick, then if it hits you, then... But if it it wasn't, then you'd be a lot easier to move out the way. 
What did mm-hmm. your your parents have to say about it when what you did came the fox home? Did you tell <laughs> did you you tell them something amazing happened today? I didn't actually tell them until a couple of years later. <laughs> until now, and they're here on the show tonight. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, I I I didn't tell them until a couple of years later. Why didn't you tell them? Because you were scared they were going to be like overprotective. I, no, I was. Yeah, I I honestly thought that. Like yeah, they just I didn't want anyone. I didn't really want to make a fuss of it because I felt fine. Hmm. That's that's. I think that's quite like you to not make a fuss out of things. Right, but but I don't know if I really ah. But then I feel like maybe the, he's trying to make it not sound very plausible because it's actually true. That is true. But then, <laughs> but is this if the, true? If, the, if the police were involved to find that the car had been burnt, yeah, then surely his parents would have been notified. Don't call me Shirley. <laughs> Um, I don't know. I think it's false. Wait, how did you find out about the car being burnt? Um, it was through because uh, obviously it was it was stolen on school property, and uh, it was, oh, it, was, it, was oh, oh, oh. it was a teacher had a Porsche. <laughs> it, it was like a Corsa. <laughs> <laughs> um, but like, um, yeah, the like the, they found it and they updated everyone in the school saying that like they haven't found the person sort of thing because they mm-hmm. the police came into like question that's quite people. believable okay because then his parents wouldn't yeah yeah all right so you it got questions true. Uh, no <laughs> oh you weren't questioned you were hit by the freaking car and you weren't questioned no i didn't tell anyone oh so were your friends there though yeah uh, two of them were there was only Did there they was, not tell you was, to... we, we were quite late because it was after a rugby game and uh, we, we were like, really grilling yeah. you about this one yeah like, we've <laughs> so many we, questions yeah there, 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 there was just the three of us and we were quite late it was after a rubber game and yeah. and they didn't say maybe you should tell the police about the fact that you were moaning me and, out me, and this. The, me and the two friends were, were so shocked at what happened even though we you did. just got a bruise yeah, well it it was like hmm. the full leg pretty much the full leg you said it was a corner before well no like no. The, the bruise was like yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. I don't know this hmm. is difficult yeah yeah We've grilled them a lot, and I'm not any more sure. What do you think? <laughs> um, I think it could be true, but I am still doubting it. Yeah, slightly. What do you think? <sighs> I defer to you. Oh, why me? Okay, I'm going to say... Maybe, maybe this might help. Oh, God, don't do it. Don't do it. No, 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 no. Oh, God, there we go. It looks like when you just have your, your shirt on, it looks like you're wearing a sweater vest. Put it, wait, put just the shirt on. Put just the shirt on. Okay. <laughs> okay, they're beautiful. Perfect. I'm going to go with... I'm going to go with true. I don't know why. I, my brain tells me it's a lie, but my heart's saying it's true. And okay. I don't know why. But I, I might, I'm probably going to be wrong. But I, I kind of want to go with true. <laughs> so, Edson, were you run over by a hijacked car? Wh- which one's which? Uh, <laughs> don't bother with it. Just... I'm not okay. going to yeah, see it say. anyway. It is truth. Yes! Whoa, well yes! Uh... What? <laughs> no! Yeah, like, he was run got... over! <laughs> no, like, yeah, yeah I, got, I was right. <laughs> Full leg bruise. That's fantastic. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> so, and you're happy with your legs now because you're a floating them. So. At the end of round one, it was a perfect score of four to none for the green team. <laughs> yes! We're really good at I, this, Ad. We are. We're 4-0 up. <laughs> I feel like I, I have the advantage of knowing all of you very well. So. <laughs> okay. When I was a kid... My parents yes. convinced me True. that the <laughs> <laughs> that, the, done. that the ice cream van sound meant they had run out of ice creams. <laughs> See now, <laughs> that's a common me. one. Surely yeah. your parents were in that cruel to do what a lot like it's been covered in TV shows and everything <clears throat> else. My parents, my parents do the opposite. And whenever an ambulance goes by, they say they'll never sell ice cream going at that speed. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Um, I wouldn't like to try that ice cream. I'm pretty sure if Edson had been hit by an ambulance, though, they'd buy him ice cream. <laughs> no, no, just they wouldn't know. Like they wouldn't know. He wouldn't tell them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Until like a couple of years later. Oh, yeah, I've I was got hit 99 by an ambulance flakes, but the Edson's just not one. You see, that's such a that is such a, 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 a typical thing that 
parents say to their like you know that as Andy said a thing that comes up a lot in like TV shows and stuff that I feel like it should be true just because but I don't know we need to ask questions. Let's grill. Um, <laughs> when did you find out that that's not what it meant? Uh, about three and weeks how? ago. No. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, it was about <laughs> when I was, I think it, it was. De- I was definitely still like I was like really early primary school. Like okay. first or second year in primary school. I don't know what age that is. Like, because I I specifically remember because I was like one of my six, friends were round, and when when he told like when he was round and the ice cream van came down, I I was like oh they're out sort of thing, and he's like, what, <laughs> 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 and obviously that's when he told, and then my parents then like, and this kid found it hilarious. That I that, that I honestly believed this until then, and it was it was a lot longer than probably I should. They should have left it. Like I I don't know when they would have stopped. It, Wait, I, so your parents I, knew that every time an ice cream truck was there, you would be like, oh yeah. And they saw you. They saw yeah. your disappointment. I, and, and for they... some reason, I didn't clock that the the fact that they why would they still be out on a route if they'd run out? Like, <laughs> were they were they the kind of parents that whenever you saw like an ice cream truck, you're like, we get an ice cream. They'd say, we've got lollies in the freezer at home. Yes. Oh, that's cruel. <laughs> that's harsh. Yeah. yeah. So you never used to spend time with uh, the other yeah, kids in your street. <laughs> And then to realise that, oh, the ice cream van's gone well, no, past and well, all no. my friends have got the, ice cream. The thing is, it always, um, I did, but I play rugby. And that's, for juniors, is on a Sunday and the ice cream van always comes down on a Sunday. So okay. I was never, like... What? I, does it come down any other day? No, it only comes down Sunday nights. Oh, it's like, nights? Okay. Yeah, well, well, like, e- 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 well, evening, like, I don't know, 5, 6 p.m. or something. But like There used to be a haunted ice cream But I, 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 I never got back from rugby until about <laughs> 7 o'clock, something like that. Because obviously we, okay. we were very sort of like, I don't know, we, we, we were at rugby like all day Sunday. That was our thing. Yeah. So what I, I, was, I was never in on a Sunday, basically. What position did you play? Number nine. The name of that? Scrum half. <laughs> 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 Just check. Mm. So, did you confront your parents about this after you found out? <laughs> well, no, they they were the one that told me because I was like, because I was tr- really trying to convince him that, like, I was like, no, that means they're out. <laughs> and then, like, my, my dad then broke the news to me, and I was, <laughs> I was, I was very much disappointed. He <laughs> shouted. Dad, he was a broken man after that day. <laughs> he was like a He's clock. like, my <laughs> son, <laughs> the imbecile. No, I'm <laughs> what is okay what was the first ice cream you got for the ice cream man after you realized that you could get ice cream from him i got a it was a 99 flake and i think i got pretty much everything you could get onto it it was like this the strawberry the chocolate stuff the chocolate flake and just mm, everything i feel like you everything. wouldn't remember that although i guess it was a really good ice cream maybe you would it, but... it was my first freaking proper ice cream it was glorious mm. Hmm, I don't know. And what, early primary school? Yeah, I would, like, the first, second year. Because I can only remember that because the mate that came around my house, he went to a different, like, they moved in, like, my third year of primary school. So it was definitely one of the first two years. So Mm. you would have been, like, six or seven, I guess. Yeah, that's far too old to still believe that. Yes, I know. Five to seven. And you did play (laughs) rugby then. So remember you telling me that you started playing at a really young age. When I was five. So that's true. Yeah, yes, there five. are elements of truth, but, but is the entire thing true? I don't know. That's that feels, the question. That feels so mean <laughs> for your parents to just watch you never you not, get ice cream. You really haven't met my parents. I haven't. That'd be kind See, of this, this is why you didn't tell them about the car incident for two years. <laughs> exactly, yeah. This is... <laughs> They'd have told you that it was a lie and you were never hit by this car. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> They'd but have it... told you that cars driving directly towards you are safe. Yes, that's why I jumped in the way of it. Oh, wait. <laughs> 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 Oh, I don't know. I mean, like, I can imagine a parent saying that to a kid and then, like, once they realise that the kid actually believed it, they'd be like, oh, no, 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 no. I can't imagine a parent sitting back and watching their kids suffer like that. I don't know. You really but maybe I've just been blessed with great, with great parents. I, I've, <laughs> I hate them for this. I'm just, yeah. I hate them. Full stop. <laughs> Mum, Dad, I know you're in the studio with us tonight. I hate you. I hate you both. <laughs> um, hmm. So, do you think it's the truth, or do you think did your did cool? your did your brother keep it a secret from you too? Then, 
Uh, yeah, and and well, no, he. I don't actually know if he. <laughs> Lie. Actually, <laughs> I don't know if he knew like earlier than me. I I feel like because I I feel like he probably clocked on sooner than me because he was a very smart kid. And I think obviously they brought him onto the lie, which was even worse because my brother was. Only oh, so a year they told both that. of you, and then he realised and thought, "Lol, I'm not going to tell the Ledson." Well, well, the thing is, like, I think my brother figured it out, and then, okay. and then obviously when he confronted them, they were like, "Look, he still knows." <laughs> it's like the tooth fairy or Santa, but instead mm-hmm. it's ice cream. Yeah, it is. <laughs> he doesn't know yet. Keep it a secret. For yeah, his exactly. Hmm. This was know. this was like their little. It's I I'm I hate them for this. I don't know, Ed. What do you think? I think I think it's probably. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think it's a half truth, and uh, it's actually you... a lie. Yeah, half I'm feeling a that. A lot of a lot of it feels. Oh, I, I thought you were answering with half truth. I think it's a half no, truth. No, no, no. We're going with true no. and lie. <laughs> I think, yeah, I think there's a there's a lot of things that are true about that story, but like, I don't know. It just seems so mean. So mean. Yeah, really I'm gonna have to go with the lie as well. I'm gonna go with okay. the lie as well. So, Edson, was it, it is a truth or a lie? A lie. Yay! <laughs> no, no parents of that. No, I only found out last week. That was the thing. No. <laughs> so hopefully you guys have enjoyed those three rounds. Um, there is a lot more of it from that. Like I say, links in the description to Penny's point of view slash podcasty style thing that she's doing with it. Um, if you do want to listen to the full one, if the link's not there, that means um, it's not uploaded yet um, or it's not out yet. I'll link to it as soon as it's out. And yes, please let let us know in the comments down below. We gave him some suggestions. The suggestions we said were um, like there's one that I like. I think Oddmas was saying like everyone sort of like stood still, um, which is not very good like for entertainment. It's very nice for a podcasty style thing, but you need a bit of something there. Um, and I think there was like a few suggestions from Penny on like different rounds that they could do. They could have like. Um, whose old skin is this or something um, so like they, they bring like a random person on that's like got a skin from like one of the contestants like one of their old Minecraft skins and the, the other panel has to work out what skin it is or whose skin it was um, and each person has to compl- claim it's theirs um, there is I give them an idea of the, the, the rounds need to be sort of like time based so the other team only has like two minutes to interrogate the person then they have to make a, a judgement um, and then that, that can make it a faster paced thing and we can edit it into a really fast paced video because obviously this is meant for people this, like this map is going to get released so people can like play it and stream it and stuff like that so there needs to be like a few things in there um, obviously the set needs to be built up he knows that um, and stuff like that and yeah just generally a, a few more sort of like things in there but if there's any ideas you have please let us know in the comments down below because i'm going to link strats to this and he wants some feedback on this this is the very first time anyone's ever played it this is the the earliest of the earliest beta um so please let us know in the comments down below i'm um, hopefully i'm going to try and w- wiggle my way into uh get into a few more of the tests it was really fun i really enjoyed it and i've got a list of loads of other choose or lies um that will be quite interesting i'll link him to everything in the comments down below um and hopefully you guys are giving us some good feedback and it can help him improve this game and hopefully i do like i say join in the future and everything like I say like comment subscribe if you're new and as always i'll speak to you all soon take care